Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. When I heard of the death of a dear brother, Jacob, I was shocked. And the first person that came to my mind was brother Raila. I called him and I asked him, what is this we are getting? And I think you remember brother Raila that you told me you couldn't even believe it. You even suspected foul play. It's important to say this. And given the circumstances that uh, Jacoyo did not, was not even asked him, did he have COVID? He told me no. It had been tested, there was no COVID. So as we bid farewell to Jacoyo, we have to remind of ourselves that we live in perilous times. And the best we can do to the family Betty, Rose, the children, one of them is very young, is to present them before God. And God Almighty in his goodness and abundant mercy will protect this family. I want to say that what has been said about Jacoyo and Parliament is singular ability to operate as a national leader. Something I will personally miss. Very brave, fearless. And I know what the demise of Jacob means to Raila. I now know, I've, never, I've always known their cousins, but now I see from what has been written that they are first cousins. And you know when you are so committed to a cause, sometimes your constituents do not understand. And I know the difficulty Raila must have had and uh, a member for game um, does recognize that this was a colossus of a man. And he had to suffer loss because of the higher belief he had in his country. So Jacob then, we we'll go down in history as one of our foremost fighters for democracy and good governance. He was in that anti-corruption committee in parliament. So, buddy and uh, member for uh, Dr. Dr. Nikal, you, you received a punch which was meant for Jacoyo. <laughs> Continue to receive any more <laughs> for the sake of this country and in remembrance of Jacoyo. The events uh, to which uh, uh, Buddy and you referred uh, are very vividly clear in my mind. What happened at the speaker's <laughs> gallery to Mugama and, uh, and uh, and to Senator Jim Marengo. I didn't see the part about Milio Diambo climbing with skirts, but I recall the serious fight that Buddy was involved in. He really fought through all kinds of punches and kicks in the name of protecting the integrity of the nation. We will miss uh, Jacoyo. And uh, we want to pledge that we will work together. You know, the Bible tells us, I think it's the book of Ephesians, as much as lieth in you, live peaceably with all men. We must therefore continue to build the bridges. Let's wait for the outcome of uh, this process now, before a bench that has already been mentioned, let us hope that justice will prevail and the reform process for the good of this country will continue. I think those are the higher ideals. Let's commit ourselves to them. May Jacoyo Medio rest in eternal peace. Amen.